Hello, I'm Justin Fisher. Here's some stories making headlines at 2 News Oklahoma. Today, marking day two of Tulsa County Sheriff's Office renewed search for two missing Turley people at the scene where another man was found dead. Deputies are headed to the home of Jack Grimes and they're bringing search dogs to look for Dwayne Selby, his mother, uh, Glenda Parton as well. All three disappeared in 2021. You know, this investigation has been going on since October of last year, so it's definitely worth coming back out here and doing a more thorough search of the property to see if we can yield any evidence that would help us move this case across the finish line. In October of 2021, officials issued a silver alert for the three, then found Grimes and Selby's car. That same month, they found Grimes' remains. On well, Sunday, divers searched water on Grimes' land for signs of the two missing people. The sheriff's office says it is just the start. And right now, Tulsa police continue to look for a suspect after a woman was shot at a Tulsa apartment complex. Officers were called to Savannah Landing near 61st and Peoria around 830 Sunday night. The police say the woman was shot at the complex, but they found her car a few blocks away. Well, she was taken to a hospital, but no word on her condition. And Tulsa police have identified the woman who was found dead in a Tulsa apartment on Saturday. Officers say an out of state family member called and asked them to check on 60 year old Cheryl Thomas at the Avondale apartments. A maintenance person opened her door, found her dead inside. Officers called the homicide unit because they did suspect foul play. They're asking any witnesses to call TPD or Crime Stoppers. All right, let's get over to Emma Landeros for a look at your Monday forecast. And we're tracking lots of sunshine with south winds returning, gusting between 20 to 25 miles per hour. Those south winds, though, are going to help temperatures climb into the upper 70s. We have that high of 79 here in Tulsa. Normally, we are around 67 degrees. Few areas in the low 80s, 81 in Okmogee and Bristow. Definitely take advantage of today before our next storm system arrives Tuesday into Wednesday, dropping temperatures down into the upper 40s, as well as severe weather potential Tuesday overnight. And then we'll see some lingering showers and thunderstorms for Wednesday.